Hello everybody, this is String Emma here for a super-sized desert, desert showdown battle, battle arena. arena. And we have got over 80 combatants. Yes, 80, which is significantly more than what we had the last time I did this, which was around Halloween time. And we got a new and improved battle arena. So as you can see, I have already released the dinosaurs into the arena and given them their respective names. And yeah, quick, t quick uh, tour of the arena. So over here, we have got Hashtag Lake with a hashtag shaped bit of water. We got a little settlement over here. We got this big ass pyramid, which does harbor a secret inside. So yes, dinosaurs will hopefully be able to go in here and uh, explore. And there's a nice little uh, tomb over there <laughs> that I built. If I can get out. Oh, I can't get out. We also have this spectacular wrestling ring which is the centerpiece of this arena, and it's also got spectators. This will be where the last couple of dinosaurs will come to finish off this uh, video. We've got a while for that yet. Um, we also have Death Pit over here, with a spike bit of spikes. And of course, we've got the Amphitheater, and we have got Pride Rock. Which is no reference to the Lion King whatsoever, but, you know, it could be. Now that that's out of the way, let's go through the combatants, shall we? And oh boy, there are a lot of them. Right, we're going to go through some of the dinosaurs, because some a lot of them have received quite a few changes. So, obviously we got a bunch of new uh, sauropods this time. So we've got Amplosaurus making its official debut. Uh, I think the other one is like somewhere over there. We've got our two Titans, Supersaurus, Seismosaurus. Will they survive? Taurosaurus making its debut here. Diceratops having a chill. Oh, it's like, it's like lightning uh, cluster over there. Uh, we have got all the alphas that featured in the showcase video are here. And we have got Ace making his... Damn it, I keep clicking the fence. We have got Ace making his official debut here. So we've got Akarnatorus, which is over there, and we got Ace. Now, Ace does like to spasm out during fights, so that is a bit of a worry. And oh, look what we got over here. We got Paris. Aww. Yeah, we got some of the chippies entering the arena. They're not going to do anything. They're just basically going to be there to be killed. So we do have Paris. Um, we have Chomp. And we also have Tank. Now, I mentioned it before. These chibis are ported from, you know, are ported from the arcade game into here. The textures do look a bit weird. It is a blend weight issue. I know exactly what the issue is. I know exactly how to fix it. But for whatever reason, 
the, the gate the uh, tool modding tools will just not allow me to inject the files that I need to uh, modify to fix it so unfortunately some of my stuff will look a bit weird I don't know how to fix it but there we go uh, yes we also have chomp make adult chomp making his uh, debut here let's see how well he does there's our alpha acrocamphosaurus is the other ampelosaurus and actually Camarasaurus has also received a bit of TLC as well with the, with his texture. And Joe Borea actually... Oh, damn it, he has to sleep, didn't he? Okay, well, I'll talk about him later because he's received a big overhaul, texture-wise and model-wise. Uh, there's a Saurolophus, there's a Deinonychus over there. There's our Alpha Deinonychus, still without its uh, featherage, but uh, <laughs> one day it'll have feathers and it'll be a momentous day. Here's a Parasaurolophus. Uh, what will we go over here? Okay, Isosaurus making his uh, debut. I suspect he will do well. There's our champ from last time, the Pachycephalosaurus. I don't know how well he'll do this time because he is back as a uh, Pachycephalosaurus cosmetic, which does mean he can be hunted down and killed. Also making a f its full debut, we have Euoplocephalus. I suspect we'll see a lot of him. Cychania also over there. Uh, we got Gone Wanna Titan. I'm not sure how long that thing's gonna last. Acrocamphosaurus. Um, I think that is it in terms of stuff I want to talk about. I mean, there'll be other things as well, but uh, I'll talk about it as the video goes on. There's Ferrazinosaurus also making a debut. Okay, where is it? There's one more thing I want to show off. And oh my God, look all the Allosaurids are not here. <laughs> is it you? Well, it's not you, but you have had a texture update, Monolophosaurus. Ah, there you are. Yes, it is official. We have got a Megaraptor. Uh, a small version of Megaraptor, because this is the DS version, which uses the smaller brick. Uh, uh, there will also be, like, a big version of him as well. There might be other variants of it <laughs> as well, if I decide to have fun. But yes, we've got the small Megaraptor here this, for this one. I finally managed to do the Ephevorage, which I think has turned out pretty nice. It does is a bit luminescent. I don't know how to fix that. But yeah, it will probably get updated over and over until I, <laughs> until I get it just right. But, you know, for a first iteration, not too bad. Um, okay, we've already well, got nothing over here. Oh, okay, yes, Gojurasaurus has also received a texture overhaul. And I think that is about it. So without further ado, let the carnage begin. Right, place your bets on who do you think is going to die for... Oh, look at that, Ferrazinosaurus in the uh, wrestling ring, as is Cryo. Hopefully we'll get to see some fights in here, but I'm worried that these lights are going to, like, stop dinosaurs from fighting. If that is the case, I will just remove them. Oh, oh, here we go. I think Monolophosaurus is about to die. <laughs> Um, yeah, you picked a good fight, didn't you? Take it on the meat of the Cachyrodontosaurus. Well, that went well for you, didn't it, buddy? Ooh, okay, we got Anchiceratops taking on Pentaceratops. We never see this. It's always freaking carnivores. Okay, Diceratops taking on Gorgosaurus over there, I think. I think that's, uh, oh, there it is. Oh, look at that. Is Pentaceratops going to get the win? I Oh, he's not. Anchiceratops, I think, comes out on top. Oh, maybe not. Okay, we've got Alpha Kentrosaurus and Alpha Woolosaurus having a fight. But I'm more intrigued by this fight, to be honest. It looks like Pentaceratops does have the upper hand. Let's have a look. Yeah. 33, 72. Yeah, definitely. Oh, and a damage tooth as well. That's not good, but a win for Pentaceratops. Alpha Sukamimus taking on the Tarbosaurus. Tarbosaurus getting the upper hand there, concussing the Alpha Sukamimus. Tarbosaurus making his official debut here. Oh, there's Paris in the background. As Sauropelta takes on Nodosaurus. I don't think this is going to go well for the Nodosaurus. Well, I'll tell you what. Wait, did he get the first but Wait. Did he kill it? He freaking killed it! Oh, that was too easy. He killed it! 
insta-killed by a nodus. <laughs> well, that is a shock. This little thing never gets a kill. Oh, bless him. He actually did something. <laughs> He's going to die in two seconds anyway, as soon as a big carnivore eyes him up. But, eh, yeah, moral victory for Nodosaurus. Yeah, if my voice sounds a bit weird, it's because I uh, do have a sore throat. But I'm battling on because I wanted to do this in battle. Right, so we've had model of Thesaurus and Soropelt to get killed. Okay, here we go. Sukumimus taking on Alpha Acrocanthosaurus. And yeah, this isn't going to go well for you, buddy. I mean, it shouldn't. Alpha Acrocanthosaurus should dominate this fight. And he is dominating so far. Absolutely battering the Sukumimus. He's going to kill it. I think Sukumimus should be in for a bite back. Oh my god, he didn't even buy him back. 12%, 100%. Domination from Alpha Acro. Okay, here we go. Atrox taking on Majungasaurus. Oh, I killed it! But the hell? The one shot in this uh, Battle Royale so far is insane. Majungasaurus getting one shotted by the Atrox. Oh, Majungasaurus usually does well. But not this time. Let's see if anyone's gone in the pyramid. Okay, so far no one has gone in the pyramid. Wait, what's on low health? Oh! Oh, I must have missed this! So the Alpha Wuasaurus must have lacerated the Kentrosaurus and is dying. So Alpha Kentrosaurus is going to be gone soon. Taurosaurus taking on Diceratops. The Lightning Dinosaurs really like having a tough clash. Lightning Dinosaurs really like fighting each other so far. I have to refill my water bottle now soon. <laughs> yeah, I keep taking sips, which means I have to keep taking bathroom breaks because I'm just... Water's coming out of me like a tap. Okay, I don't think anything... I think they've uh, called it off. And yeah, major fracture. The Diceratops is going to go down. The Taurosaurus showing no mercy. Okay, you're concussed. I, I can't believe Nodosaurus freaking killed the uh, Soropelt. <laughs> Oh, oh, this isn't going to go well for the uh, Afrovenator, I don't think. And, oh, Sukumimus! Wasted by the Tarbosaurus. Alpha Sukumimus downed. Tarbosaurus getting his first kill. Oh, really, Kentrosaurus? You're picking a fight with that? Wait, hang on a minute. Is his eyes coming out? Uh-oh. Um. <laughs> um. I... Don't know what's happening here. Stegosaur should not be doing that. Oh, I think this is the end for Gojirasaurus. Ooh, here we go. Giganontosaurus gonna take hunt down the Gondwana Titan. Oh no! Run, little fella! Oh, he's not even trying to love him. Wait, did he escape? Oh, he freaking did it! Oh, you did it, buddy! You escaped! Gondwana Titan lives to fight another day. Nope. Will Shant live to fight another day? Oh. <laughs> the friggin' Matusaurus is taking a crack at him now. <laughs> oh dear. Is he gonna escape this one? I don't think so. Nope! Not a chance on planet Earth. Oh no! He did so well to escape the Giga, but he did not escape the Matusaurus. Pentaceratops versus Ace. Ace getting the first hit here. Oh, I'm missing so many epic fights. This is a problem with, at the start, because you miss so many. Oh, wow. <laughs> Ooh, nice little clash there. Yeah, the animations are a little bit like uh, the ace, because it is scaled down. And yeah, Pentaceratops took an absolute lash in there. T-Rex taking on Ankylosaurus. And Ankylosaurus getting battered. Ankylosaurus, for one of the larger herbivores in this, really does suck. Right, I need to see who's died. So, Met died to Fairy, Alpha Suko died to Tarb, Sauropelta died to Nodosaurus, Papasaurus died to Albertosaurus, Gojurasaurus died. Wait, Alpha Gorgo killed Diceratops? I think it just that just happened. Uh, Kentrosaurus died to Alpha Wursaurus. And Majungasaurus died to Atrox. So we've had quite a lot of deaths so far. Oh, look at this! The Supersaurus has entered the wrestling ring. 
Okay. Oh, oh it's Mega Raptor taking on the Alpha. Di Hang on, I need to capture those deaths. Mega Raptor taking on the Alpha Deinonychus. And he gets the kill. Mega Raptor killing the Alpha Deinonychus here in style. Oh, at least you did something useful, buddy, before you die. Yeah. That is a kill for the Mega Raptor. Ooh, here we go. Chomp taking on the Eocarcaria. Oh, Eocarcaria did get the first hit. Chomp. The Triceratops, one of the strongest herbivores in this. Ooh, gets a good hit off there, Chomp. But I think Eocarcaria is definitely on top so far. And yeah, and then another clash. Okay, some scars on the Eocarc, but Chomp is losing a lot of his colour. That didn't go well for Chomp. 28 to 76. Eocarc here, are really dominant there. Wait, what else has died? So one of the Deinonychus has died. We do have three Deinonychus in here. Like normal. Wait, when did this happen? Tajongasaurus organ trauma. Tajongasaurus will go down and the Stegosaurus does have a broken claw. It's not good. Okay, Taurosaurus taking on Despletosaurus. Uh, Despletosaurus... It has been updated, has received a texture update. It definitely looks a lot more epic now. Can it finish off the Taurosaurus here? Oh, okay, there's a clash. And yeah, that didn't go well for Taurosaurus, I don't think. Nope, wow, 91%. Oh, the Pentaceratops going down. The T-Rex finishing the job. Okay, we got Kentrosaurus taking on Ankyceratops. I think. No? Okay, maybe not. Oh no! Baryonyx biting the dust against Delta Dromius. And so far, these Allosaurs, these guys just want to sleep. <laughs> oh, the Spinosaurus. Ooh, he is hungry, but he hasn't. But he's just sleeping for some reason. Now, there are quite a few dead bodies. I will leave them around, lying around early on so the carnivores can feed. So, yeah. Carnivores starve to death. Herbivores do not. That's the, uh, the uh, evening factor I like to give on the uh, Tarvis. Oh, look at this. Taurosaurus coming up. Pride Rock. Now, we got to capture mode this. Oh, no. Don't turn around. <laughs> do, 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 do. <laughs> Okay. Oh, no! You want the Cephalus? Killed by Mapusaurus. We barely saw it. Lantusaurus. Oh, oh, hang on. No. Oh, no! There it is. Nodosaurus picked the fight with the big boy and paid the price. <laughs> he killed the Zoropelter, but he was no match for the Therizinosaurus, who has two kills. Therizinosaurus doing well. Okay, we got Wuhosaurus taking on Triceratops. I don't think this is going to go well for the Wuhosaurus. Oh, hang on. We got Tarbisaurus taking on Gorgosaurus. Tarbisaurus has looked really strong in the, at the minute, but it does take a hit. See, Tarbisaurus does get the hit back. But Gorgosaurus does strike back. I think Gorgosaurus is going to win this fight. Oh, look, there's the Mega Raptor. Don't know what he's running from. Probably the Despletosaurus. And yeah, Gorgosaurus does win. Oh, I think this is the end for... Uh... Oh, hang on, we got to do this one. It is Ace taking on T-Rex. I think Tajongosaurus is going to die over there to the Steg. And yeah. Stegosaurus landing a kill there. I don't think this is going to go well for Ace. Oh, look, the other Carnotaurs coming in to help. He's like, get him! Ace never seems to do well against the T-Rex. Well, he, he's always suffered against Terry. Oh, Seismosaurus, I think. Supersaurus, sorry, is leaving the arena. I tell you what, though, he's putting up a good fight. T-Rex not getting his own way, but he does win the fight. Oh, the organ trauma debt. Wait, what? Oh, no. What are you doing? No, kill Chomp. <laughs> the Megaraptor killed Chomp. Oh, bless. No. <laughs>
Oh no, the Uteraptor died. The Uteraptor died the cock. Oh, here we go. T-Rex taking on Supersaurus there. He's hungry. Let's have a look. And yeah, Supersaurus tanking it like a boss. The T-Rex is going to have to do better than that. Now, one thing I did notice is that when a carnivore hunts one of these large sauropods, another one will go after it. So these sauropods don't have much time to recover. But will we see a sauropod win for the first time ever? Remember, I think it wasn't the last one, but I think the one before that, Joe Borea, he came so close to winning. I think he came third. Well, there's the end of Kralophosaurus. Okay, we got Sorolophus taking on Megalosaurus. This could be interesting. Sorolophus, one of the herbivores that can fight back. And of course, it gets hit first. And yeah, he has received. Although it'll be very uh, barely noticeable, but he has received a texture update. It's mainly the yellow bit, but it's so subtle you won't even notice it. And yet, clobbered by the Megalosaurus, and yet, 13% health doesn't look good for him. Although this, ooh, okay, here we go, Tyrannosaurus rat. Wait, what? They freaking killed it! The Despletosaurus has killed T-Rex. Oh, that's your few, that's your freaking grandson, mate. The Daspletosaurus wasting the T-Rex. The T-Rex was getting hungry. It couldn't kill the Supersaurus. And Daspletosaurus picked him off. Wow, that was our first big shock. The T-Rex gone already. Wait, where is Black T-Rex? I haven't seen that thing for ages. Okay, so you have an ingrown claw. Which is not good. Oh, speak of the devil. There he is. <laughs> I think he's about to kill the Ankyceratops. Wait, what? The freaking Ankyceratops got the first hit? No, you're not going to kill Black T-Rex. Surely not. <laughs> Surely the Ankyceratops is not going to win. Black T-Rex doesn't look good at all. This is the advantage the herbivores have. They don't starve to death. The carnivores can. The carnivores have to fight and look at that. The freaking Ankyceratops is gonna win! He freaking won! Okay, oh my god. 19% health. Okay, we got Lexovasaurus taking on Cychania there. Oh, what was that then? I think that was Meg taking on something. Oh, I think he killed the Lanzusaurus. Yeah, he killed Lanzusaurus. Megalosaurus. Actually, how many kills do you have? Okay, you have four victories and two kills. Megalosaurus doing well. Uh, is this finally going to be the end for Taurosaurus? He's done well to survive, but yeah, Gorgosaurus is going to waste him, I think. Well, are these two having a res resumption of their matchup? If you did see the uh, Alpha Showcase, the Gorgosaurus it's, were insanely strong. I think they killed everything. So, a good bet would be Despletosaurus to win. Uh, let's have a look. 16 to... Oh, wow, Triceratops is really dominant. Yeah, Wurosaurus can't get a... Can't get a hit. Will Trike get the finishing blow? Oh, no. Wurosaurus does get another hit on the board. But he does have a broken claw, which is not good for Wurosaurus. Right, where is Spinosaurus? Where is Spinosaurus? Wait, what did you die to? Wait, you died to Albertosaurus? Okay, Sukumimus died to Eocarcaria. Wait, Alpha Acrocanthosaurus is dying. You bugger, you got you got no food. I mean, there's, there are feeders around here. You just can't get to them. Right, where's Spinosaurus? Wait, what? Spinosaurus is also... Like, why are you sleeping, dude? You're hungry. Get some food. So Spinosaurus, not looking good at all. I think... Wait, Acrocanthosaurus is starving? Okay, here we go. Mapusaurus taking on Isosaurus here. Can Isosaurus survive? No, run with Lysosaurus. Well, you're not that little. Let's have a look. Will he take it? Will he survive? I think he did. Okay, he took a little bit of damage, but he did survive. These sauropods are going to be hard to bring down. Okay, so we got... Oh, this might not be a good idea for the Spino. The Afrovenate, they're taking him on. Spinosaurus, desperate for food. And that could cost him. 
the Afrovanita gets the first hit. Is this the end of Spino? A fan favourite, a favourite in this. Is he going down? Let's have a look. But he killed it! The Afrovanita wasting the Spinosaurus. And that is it for Spinosaurus going down. T-Rex gone, Spinosaurus gone. The big carnivores really struggling at the minute. Well, unless you're a uh, Gorgosaur or an Albertosaur or a Despletosaur, that is. Let's have a look. Yep, there goes Saurolophus. Finished off by the Mapusaurus. Oh no, Megaraptor's gone. Killed by the Eokaki. Oh, look at him, he's covering his eyes. Bless him. That is it for Megaraptor. No match for Eokarkaria. Who has basically declared this arena his uh, domain. <laughs> he's like... Yes. Enter my arena if you did. Wait, what? Freaking black T Rex starved to death? Oh no. Oh no. The black T Rex. Oh, what an underwhelming death for the black T Rex. <laughs> Just starved to death. <laughs> Wait, Atrox got internal bleeding? I tell you what, I think this might be a victory for the herbivores here. All the carnivores really struggle at it. I mean, there are feeders around here, so they haven't they ain't got no excuse. So, let's have a look what's died over here. So, Yangchungasaurus starved to death. Well, it did nothing but sleep. Did it actually do anything? Oh, it had one loss. And that was it. Oh, Ace is gone. Ace is dead. Died of unknown cause. I think it did get an injury against the T-Rex. So, yeah, Ace is gone. Atrox, internal bleeding. So I think Atrox is going to die as well. Wait, is, it, is he trying to line something up? Oh, no. Ceratosaurus is gone. We, well, we didn't see this at all. Oh, here we go. Delta Dromius is going to hunt down the Shunosaurus by the looks of it. <laughs> the Ed Edmontosaurus is going to He's like, run. And yeah, there it is. Shunosaurus gone. Okay, Acrocanthosaurus taking on Iguanodon. And I think Atrox is going to get picked off by the Giga. As the Iguanodon is wasted by Acrocanthosaurus. But yeah, a lot of the big carnivores have really struggled. Oh no, the uh, Zuni Ceratops has died to Megalosaurus. Actually, you're one of the ones that did get a slight texture tweak. So you look a bit darker. Um, so far... It's been advantage herbivores. Oh, it's up. this could be interesting. Chomp taking on Alpha Gorgosaur. I swear, if one of these Gorgosaurs or freaking Albert or Das win, I'm gonna, that's going to be absurd. Hmm. Not good for Chomp so far, though. Alpha Gorgosaurus. Oh, look at this Petasaurus is coming in there. <laughs> Oh, I think Alpha Chasmosaurus is... Look at Alpha Chasmosaurus dead over there. And yeah, there goes the colour from Chomp again. And what is that? That's two fight losses. <laughs> well, he's a fighter. Mapusaurus taking on the, a small shaft, we should say. And I think we know how that's going to end. Ooh, this is interesting. And yep, Carcharodontosaurus does land the first hit. Eocarcaria and Kark have done well so far, so I'm not surprised that the Albertosaurus is struggling here. I don't know what the Supersaurus is doing over there. He's like raising his neck. He's having a look. And yeah, let's have a look. 47 to 64. Ooh, oh, okay, hang on a minute. Let's have a look. Oh, okay, we got a clash. Oh, look at that! Is Alpha Acrocanthosaurus going to go down? Oh, hang on! Is he, he freaking killed it! Alpha Wuasaurus has killed Alpha Acrocanthosaurus. Where do you ever see that? You love to see it. And that is a victory for the Wuasaurus. Oh, it's killed two things. Really impressive from Alpha Wuasaurus so far. And the Alpha Acro bite in the dust. Oh, Myasaurus got hunted down by Albertosaurus. When did that happen? 
Well, round one didn't go well for Chomp, so I don't think round two is going to go well for him either. <laughs> Look at them two in the background watching it. Like, oh, we will have the. We will have. What's that? Does Plenosaurus do? He's dancing. He freaking. He's a dancing dino. He's like circling his prey. Oh, the Albertosaurus has come over as well. <laughs> Look at them all. Like vultures to a carcass. They're like, yes, get him. Get him, lads. <laughs> They're all gonna team up on Chomp. Oh, poor Chomp. I tell you what, he survived, but major fracture. He's not gonna survive this time. That's three defeats for Chomp, and Chomp is gonna go down. And <laughs> look, look at them all. They're <laughs> just eyeing him up. They're like, yes, yes, we will fish for a week. <laughs> These guys are like bullies, okay? Nobody likes a bully. Although, he did leave his mark. A broken claw. Wait, is he sleeping? He's like sleeping the Supersaurus. But why are you sleeping? A Sauropharganax has done... Oh, he's had one defeat. He's done naff all. Oh no, I think this is the end for Stegosaurus. Megalosaurus is very proactive. Let's have a look with his uh, tiptoe legs. Yeah, oh, hang on, maybe not. Yeah, Megalosaurus was one of the ones that I did scale up. To match its DK size a bit better. And yeah, it, it was my first attempt, so the animations do look very jiffy. Albert taking on Kark. Let's have a look. Oh, Albertosaurus winning, I think. 72 to 59. Yeah, Carcurodontosaurus is hungry as well, so he does need to eat soon. And I have removed all the carcasses, so... Yep. Yeah. Oh, hang on a minute. He's on the recovery. Oh, so Chomp might actually survive. Wow, he is so resilient. <laughs> actually, I, I think all these... Actually, now that I think about it, all these little guys, I think, will survive because... Wow, <laughs> we still got the baby Maya. Wait, what? It disappeared. Oh, we still got him. Oh, right, here we go. Supersaurus is uh, being eyed up now by Delta Dromius. Now, Supersaurus did fight off something earlier. So I suspect he will fight them off again. Look at him, guys. See if he uh, survived. Okay, he did take damage. So the Supersaurus did take a bit of damage there. 64%. And he is low on stamina, so... Might be... An opportunity here for another carnivore to finish him off, and the Acrocanthosaurus is nearby. And sad to say, nobody's going in this bloody pyramid. Yeah, I think the uh, Chomp. Okay, let's see what survived. So we got Chomp. No, we got Tank. Okay, we still got Terry. Which I don't think can be hunted by anything that's left now. I think the Megaraptor's, the Utahraptor's gone. Oh, we still got Ferrazinosaurus. Oh, we got Paris over here. So all the Chibis survived except Chomp. Alright, I think this is the end for Stegosaurus. And yeah, there it is. Mapinosaurus wasting no time at all. And you've done well. Will Mapusaurus win again? He has won one before. You know. Oh, finally, some action for these two. Sorofaganax taking on Giganontosaurus. So, we, well, we haven't seen Sorofaganax at all. He's just been sleeping. <laughs> He's lazy. Let's have a look. Minor fracture. Oh, lacerated. One fight from the Sorofaganax and is lacerated, and he is going to die. So that is it for Sorofaganax. Ooh, organ trauma from the Torvosaurus. I think it did fight the Albertosaurus. Torvosaurus gonna go down. Let's have a look, actually. So you have had 
Oh, you've had three defeats, actually, so you have been very active. Oh, is he going to finish him off? No. You have been very active in this. Das Pletosaurus, one kill, which was the T-Rex, and two victories. And this guy just has three victories and no kills. And then this guy got five wins, one loss, and one kill. Oh, hang on. We got these two having a fight first. And it's Delta Dromius landing the first hit. Can he pull this off? Can he defeat the former winner of Ma in Mapusaurus? Okay, so we got Triceratops taking on Kawa. And that's laceration for the Mapusaurus. He will go down. Carnotaurus taking on the Triceratops. Triceratops does get did get the first hit, I think. Oh, and that was the only hit. Oh. Dasplitosaurus getting its second kill, picking off the Torvosaurus. As the Edmontosaurus goes down to the cark. Oh wow, we still got Cychania alive and Ceratops. This is a much more peaceful area now that the Megalosaurus is gone. Giganonosaurus taking a crack at the Supersaurus. Giganonosaurus not in a good shape at the minute. He is starving, so he needs this kill. Can he get it? I mean, the Sauropagnax is dying over there, so we could just finish him off. And yet, yeah, the hunt failed. Supersaurus tanking another hit. Oh, I think this is the end for Mapusaurus. And yes, it is, and I forgot to slow down the speed. Oh, and the Sauropagonax also gets picked off, and the Acrocamphosaurus is gone. Killed by the Afrovenator. Tell you what, Afrovenator's had a... Had a good little run. He, kill, he killed Spinosaurus, and he's killed Acrocamphosaurus. More carnivores bite in the dust. Oh, no, I think this is the end. The end of Chomp. Finally finished off. I mean, he, he suffered four defeats and three scars. He was a fighter, but unfortunately, the Albertosaurus just proven too strong in the end. And they finally get the job done. All right, what we got here? Ooh, okay. Alpha Iguanodon, which we haven't seen any of, taking on Ulti Rhinus. Hmm, this is an interesting fight. Actually, where's Seismosaur? Oh, there he is. He's over there. Okay, how did this one? I think the Iguanodon one, yeah. Oh, it didn't take any damage. And the Ulti Rhinus took a bit of damage there, which is not good for him. Oh, here we go. Gorgosaurus taking on Ampelosaurus. Can Ampelosaurus survive? Well, he's fleeing. Oh, no, he got him. Is he going to kill him? No. And oh, my God, he took no damage either. Man, these sauropods are tough. Okay, we've got Daspletosaurus taking on Delta Dromius. Daspletosaurus gets the first hit. I don't know why he's semen. <laughs> oh, oh, what have I done? What have I done? Oh, no, never mind. The, uh, the Delta Dromius won that fight. Does Pletosaurus took a batter in? Right, what else did we have? Wait, what? Oh, Megalosaurus died! It died to Kark. I must have missed that. Right, I have segregated the arena and uh, cornered off this area so they're a little bit closer. So hopefully we'll get some more fight action. Ah, you, oh, of course it all happens at once. Well, I think this is going to be the end for Parasaurolophus. I think Camarasaurus and Apatosaurus are having like a uh, little bit of a tussle. And yeah, there it is. There goes Parasaurolophus, despite the fact that it can fight back, is no match for Gorgosaurus. And who else is fighting? I think it's over here. And, ooh, Carcharodontosaurus laying the beat down on Albertosaurus. That's, oh my god, it's got four defeats. He certainly likes getting in on the action, doesn't he? 
Okay, here we go. Cochirodontosaurus is going to hunt down the Jorboria, but we got a Frobonator taking on the Giganonosaurus. Oh, look at that massive hit from the Giga. I think that that's going to be it for the uh, our Frobonator. I cannot see it surviving after this. 8% health. It's took an absolute hammer in. And he's got a major injury, which means he's probably going to die. Oh, no, it's not lethal, is it? It's a... He'll survive. And I think the Joboria survived as well. Uh, where is the Joboria? Oh, he's over there. Oh, he didn't survive. I think it did. Oh, it took a little bit of damage. And it does have a spring, so that could be a problem. Oh, hello. We got Lexovasaurus taking on Cychania. Boosh! Well, it was taken on Cychania, but the Cychania killed it. Oh no, the Gorgosaur taking on a Patasaurus. Finally, these sauropods are seeing some action. Okay, you got a sprain as well, so you took some... You definitely took damage from that Gorgosaurus. And they could hunt... They could bring it down together. Wait, what are you doing? Oh, you're hunting Jorborea now. The carnivores have sensed some weakness in these sauropods. They're going to go for it. Are you going to go for it or not? Uh, hello? Okay, now he's going for it. Oh, he's got a decent amount of stam left, so he might be okay. But yeah, once that stam gets low, the carnivores will sense that and they'll finish him off. He's trying to line it up. Well, let's come back to that. Oh, we got Pachyrhinosaurus! Oh, correction. We had Pachyrhinosaurus. But it died. Ooh, Alpha Gorgosaurus going down to the cock. Cockerodontosaurus wasting no time at all. And he did come in second last year, cock, so he'll be looking to go one better. And look at that, seven victories, six total kills. This cock is going to be a force to be reckoned with. But I tell you who could be a dark horse here, Delta Dromius. Delta Dromius has had some good fights. And look at that, six wins, four kills. Delta Dromius is not one to be sniffed at. And yeah, he defeats the Carnotaurus. And concusses it as well. I think we could up, this could be our dark horse, ladies and gentlemen, Delta Dromius. Look at these two trying to get up Pride Rock. Ooh, oh, okay, well, the Deinonychus biting the dust against Cychania. <laughs> He's a savage, she's a savage, apparently. Cychania, two kills, two victories. Could it be an outsider for the herbivores? I doubt it, but, you know, here's hoping, I guess. I mean, let's not forget, Pachycephalosaurus freaking won last time. <laughs> and that was a big underdog story. Okay, here we go. Kark is going after the Apatosaurus, I think. Oh, no, he's going to try to make a beeline for the arena, but he's not going to make it. Can he at least survive this hunt? I think he did. So have a look. 70, yeah, 78%. 70, hunt failed. The Apatosaur, these sauropods proving really tough to take down. Okay, we'll have a look at this fight. Because Daspeakosaurus has been a very interesting one. Taking on the Giganonosaurus. I think he does have a couple of scars on him. Ooh! Oh, wow! Daspletosaurus getting the first shot there, but I think he's got scars as well. But I think it's going to be Daspletosaurus's victory. Oh, look at that! In the scorching desert, these two fighting for dominance, fighting for survival. And I think it's Daspletosaurus coming out on top. And yeah, definitely. Oh, look at that organ trauma. That is it for Giganonosaurus. Oh, Eocarcaria taking a crack at Supersaurus. Supersaurus has been hunted down a lot. Okay, he did take a bit of damage there. Eocarcaria, though, unable to put him down. These big, these big boys are surviving. Tanking hits like a boss. Oh no, he's going after the baby Maya. <laughs> Look at freaking Terry there. 
We gotta get Captain Mode for this. Oh no! Yeah, I'm... No! Let's pay rip to the baby buyer. He's like, help me! Nom, nom. Well, I'll give it props. It lasted longer. Let's uh, just list the na the names of the dinosaurs that it outlasted here. T-Rex, Spinosaurus, Black T-Rex, Alpha Acro, Normal Acro. So, you know, a moral victory for the baby Maya. But yeah, someone finally noticed the easy meal and took it. Okay, okay, this could be an interesting one. Carnotaurus taking on a Frovenator. And Carnotaurus laying the beat down on a Frovenator. Wow, took, took no prisoners there. And that is a Frovenator dead and buried. But it did have a good run, and it did kill Spino, so we'll give it props for that. Well, I don't think this is going to go well for the Anchiceratops. Eucarcaria and Kark have been really strong. Okay, so Gorgosaurus is going to hunt down the Ampelosaurus. But... Oh, there he is. Let's see if he can bring him down. Oh, there goes Anchiceratops. And I think, yeah, Ampelosaurus survived him. Did, again, it did take some damage. Hmm. I think the problem the carnivores have, they're not trying hard enough. <laughs> they're not trying hard, they're not repeatedly attacking them. If they do that... Oh no! Cychania has gone! The Gorgosaurus took its loss out on Cychania. Oh, she had a good run, I suppose, but yeah. <laughs> Right, who do we actually have left? So we got Isosaurus left, we got Pachycephalosaurus, we got Ankylosaurus. Well, Tank, I'm going to say Tank, Terry, and Paris are probably already won. Because I think all the Deinonychus are dead. And nothing can attack them. We've got Ferrazinosaurus still. Okay, he's going for the uh, DS Ampelosaurus this time, wherever that thing is. Oh, there he is. Let's have a look. Is he going to be successful? Probably not. Oh, wow. That was a big hit. That's definitely the... Oh, yeah. Delta Dromius is going for him now. They, they smell blood. And this is going to be the first sauropod death. And it is going to be the DS Ampelosaurus biting the dust. Yeah, that's, that has to be fatal, surely. Yeah, there it goes. Ampelosaurus, the DS Ampelosaurus going down. That cock really done damage. I'll tell you who else is doing damage. Triceratops. Oh, maybe not. 65, oh, definitely not. Okay, here we go. He's going after the Camarasaurus. Oh, it's at Pride Rock. No, you're cornered, buddy. Ah, no. Um, 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 um. Let's have a look. 60. Oh, he got lacerated. Yep, yeah, that's it for Kamarasaurus. Now the sauropods are starting to drop. That lacer... It did survive, but the laceration does mean that Kamarasaurus is going to go down eventually. The carnivores are up in their game now. Oh, <laughs> just an Ampelosaurus in the way. Carnotaurus taking on Kark. That's not a good idea. Kakarodontosaurus has been really dominant so far. And this is another show of dominance from the Kark taking out Carnotaurus. And contorting it, apparently. And yeah, nine victories. He has to be the favourite. Oh, hang on. We do have a Deinonychus. So we do have one Deinonychus. Okay, so the Chibis can still be killed. But yeah, that's it for Carnotaurus. I, you have to say it's got to be this. It's going to be Carcharodontosaurus, I think. Let's have a look. Are these two going to fight? Woo! 
Seismosaur is getting a bit of action. You can't hear it taking on the moon. Um, let's see if Seismosaurus can tank it. Oh, he's biting nothing apparently. Let's have a look. 91. Oh, yeah, easy. Oh, oh, hang on. Oh, he freaking killed it. There goes the Deinonychus. The Pachycephalosaurus gets a kill. It got to see some action. And it does get a kill on Deinonychus. Um, actually, leave a comment down below. Should I do, like, a mini one? Like, one with, like, the mini guys? Because they don't see as much action, because they usually just get one-shotted. That's something I could definitely do in the future. Because I have quite a few small ones now. So, Joe Borea on the recovery. Kark and Gorg. Eo Kark and Albert. Albert. Two fights for the price of one, and look at that, Gorgosaurus looking battered there. As is the Albertosaurus, 28%. Although Eocarcaria does get a... Does take some damage, 75. It's got internal bleeding! That's it for Albertosaurus, he is done. And that's laceration for the Gorgosaurus, which means he is also done. Carcurodontosaurus and Eocarcaria, utter dominant. Right, I have cut the arena right down now, so it's just this quadrant over here, because there's a lot of guys over here doing naff all. It's like a sanctuary. Sanctuary, no more. So who do we have left? So we have Despletus. Okay, Kark is taking a crack at the Supersaurus. Supersaurus has been probably by far the most hunted sauropod. But he's just taking the hits. Wait, did he escape? Oh, no. Kark did do a big damage on that Amplosaurus before, so... Oh, wow. 3%. <laughs> oh, you're going to have to try harder than that, buddy. Ooh, some action in the arena. Oh, never mind. Okay, Delta Dromia's taking on Triceratops. Delta Dromia's getting the first hit there. Okay, Triceratops retaliating though. Not beaten yet. Let's have a look. 37% to 69. No, Delta Dromia is definitely on top. Okay, this could be interesting. Daspletosaurus taking on Carcurodontosaurus. Wait, did he get the first hit? Oh, he did! Daspletosaurus landing the first shot! Okay, Kark getting the retaliation, though. Who's got more fire in their belly? And it looks like it's Despletosaurus. The Carcurodontosaurus has been an absolute machine in this so far, but look at it. And it's got all good trauma. That is it for the Kark. He is going down. After 10 victories, he has been bested by Despletosaurus. And it is game over for the Kark, who I really thought was going to win this. And Delta Dromi has tried his luck against the uh, Supersaurus. Okay, done a, well done more damage than the Kark did. Despletosaurus taking on Seismosaurus now. Um, okay, I think we know how that fight's going to end, so I won't uh, watch that one. Because, uh, yeah, Gorgosaur is going down to the uh, Eocarcaria. And does Plethosaurus, let's have a look. Oh, wow. It took no damage. I have a feeling that these sauropods might actually win. By sheer numbers and just longevity. Well, except for the Camarasaurus, because it'll die. But, yeah, there's only a few carnivores left, actually. Um, is this the end for Albertosaurus? Yes, it is, and it's Delta Dromius getting the kill. I think we got Delta Dromius and Albertosaurus and Despletosaurus and an Eocarcaria left. And that is it. And let's not forget, we have got Pherizinosaurus, who is a factor here. Okay, Delta Dromius is eyeing a crack at Isosaurus. 
Let's see if Isosaurus will survive this. Yo, get off. Let's have a look. Uh, not much damage dealt there, 88%. Oh no, there it goes. Kamarasaurus popped its clogs after being lacerated. And that is the second of our large sauropods to go down. Okay, we got Alpha Iguanodon taking on Delta Dromius. Let's have a look how this goes. I suspect it'll go Delta Dromius's way. Whenever he decides to bite. Uh, yeah, here we go. Oh my god, it's not even going to get a hit. 9% health. This Delta Dromius hasn't even been hit. And yeah, Organ Trauma. There goes Alpha Iguanodon. And that is uh, another win for Delta Dromius. Who is really doing well this time? Ooh, we've got some action in the arena. Pachnosaurus is being hunted down by the Del Delta Dromeos. Let's have a look. Ooh, it did take a bit of damage. Okay, here's a big fight. Eocarcaria taking on Despletosaurus. And I think Eocarc did get the first hit there, which is not good for Despletosaurus. Let's have a look. Can Daspletosaurus rally back here? I don't think he can. Okay, didn't get an injury though, so that's not too bad. That's not the worst case scenario. And yep, there it is. Carcharodontosaurus biting the dust after being so dominant in this. Um, right, this might get a little bit crowded here. <laughs> in the uh, bigger wrestling ring. Oh no, he's going for the Apatosaurus. Let's have a look. Is the Apatosaurus going to take some damage? Oh my god. Oh, it's a, he one shot it. Apatosaurus taken out by the Eocarcaria, who wasted no time at all in dispatching the big boy. So that is Apatosaurus gone. We still have quite a lot of dinosaurs left, but the. Well, again, the, all the Deinonychus is... Oh my god, he's not stopped. He's going for the Joboria. Run, little Job, run! Wait, is he trying to line it up? I don't think... It says hunt him. Okay, Despletosaurus is going for the Ampelosaurus. Now the sauropods are getting hunted down. Now, they might have trouble because of the uh, lights here, which might be a problem after the delete Okay, let's have a look. Are these two going to fight? No. He's, tr he's trying to hunt him down, but he just can't seem to do it. And the Eocarc is eyeing up the Jobaria as well. Oh, okay, he got him that time, I think. Let's have a look. Is it fatal? No! And in fact, he took no damage. Right, as for the Ampelosaurus. Again, no damage. Oh, Triceratops taking on Kentrosaurus. Yeah, forget about these herbivores. Okay, so the Eocarc is going after the uh, Ampelosaurus again. This is going to be carnage in this arena. Oh, maybe not. And yet again, Ampelosaurus surviving. And now he's, now he's going after the Jobaria again. Oops. Um, I think I'm probably going to have to get rid of the lights. Yeah, I think I might have to. Go to Spletosaurus taking on Ulti Rhinus. And I think we know how it's going to end for the Ulti Rhinus. It's going to end in death. Wait, what, wait, what got injured? Wait, is, was it the Jobaria? Oh, it's the Jobaria! Oh, and it's contorted to death because it's rig edited. <laughs> Jobaria biting in the dust against Eocarcaria. Thus, Apatosaurus and Jobaria, Eocarcaria is taken down now. 
And oh my god, Ankylosaurus is getting some action. This thing has done nothing. This whole this whole video, this thing has done nothing. Oh wait, it has lost a fight. Okay, I take it back. Well, we didn't see it, so it didn't happen. And all that, just for the ferry to win. But here's a more interesting fight. Eocarcaria taking on Delta Dromius. They've been trying it for the past five minutes. Well, okay, he's got a minor fracture. That's not too bad. But the Eocarcaria did win that fight, and it didn't take any damage at all. So I think Eocarcaria might win this. And the Muttaburrosaurus being hunted down by Dispetosaurus. Uh oh, he's going for Supersaurus. Let's have a look. Can the Supersaurus survive? Nope. Fleeing, fleeing. Is he going to survive? I don't know if he's going to. I mean, he's got. Oh, he's low on stamina. That's not good. I think, is this going to be it for Super Saur? Get out of the way, Paris! <laughs> oh, we'll watch this fight while the Eocarcaria struggles to line up the uh, Super Saurus. Uh, Alpha Vuasaurus. I think he killed. Yeah, he killed Alpha Acrocanthosaurus earlier. But I think Triceratops might be a bit too good for it. Let's have a look. Well, I'll tell you why. Got a head off. Oh, it's lacerated. Yeah, that's it for Alpha Vuasaurus. He is going down. And actually, I think he is the very last one to survive. Oh, the Ulti Rhinos got internal bleeding. So he is going down. And as for the Alphas, yeah. Alpha Vuhasaurus, the last one standing. I mean, I'll give it its, cr I'll give it its credit, because it did kill the Alpha Aphrocanthosaurus. Oh, looks like Ferry and Anki are going to finish their fight. No. Oh, hang on. Nope, nope. We've got a fight. Oh, it's Eocarcari again. The first shot. Yeah. I think Eocarcari is going to win this. Then again, I said that about the Kark and it died, so... What do I know, eh? I mean, we still got Ferrazinosaurus. Lacerated! That's it for Despletosaurus. He is going to go down. Eocarcaria landed yet another victory. Although, saying that, he is hungry. Wow, that's 11 victories overtaking the Kark now. And some, somehow, Uluru Titan is still standing. Right, let's have a look. Okay, Supersaurus took damage there. 57%. How many times has this thing been hunted? And it's still going. <laughs> it's harmless, apparently. <laughs> 57 is fleeing. Wait, is Eocark still going for it? Yeah, he is going for it. Okay, I think this has to be it. Surely this has to be it. Triceratops and Delta Dromius. 19%! It's escaped! It's somehow escaped! It's still going. Okay, I think this could be the end for Triceratops. Let's have a look. Okay, Delta Dromius did... These carnivores are taking damage. But yeah, Delta Dromius won that. And the Triceratops got a minor fracture. So that's not good. Somehow this thing's still alive. <laughs> it's like the carnivores just forget about the big herbivores. The ones that can actually be killed. And well, these two are still having another tussle. How are you still alive? Like, honestly, how are you still alive? <laughs> like, you are just a legend for surviving this long. As is the Pachycephalosaurus as well. Well, there goes the... Wait, what? Wait, what did you die of? You didn't have any injuries. Well, there goes the Ankylosaurus, useless as ever. Wait, we got we still got we still got some tails. <laughs> A lot of these like helpless herbivores have survived done well to survive. Wait, what is he are they like having a neck measuring contest? Oh look at that Supersaurus. He has been like Supersaurus deserves to win this because he has just been through the wars. And he has been hunted down by so many carnivores, probably more than all the other sauropods put together. 
Okay, so these carnivores are getting hungry, which is not good. Okay, here we go. Eocarp versus the Splitosaurus. Who will reign supreme? Now, both of these two need a kill here. And it's Eocarcaria that gets it. That's the end for the Splitosaurus. It put up a valiant fight and it had some really great moments. But unfortunately, it just ran out of gas in the end and Eocarcaria finishes him off. Oh, and now he's going for the Pachycephalosaurus. <laughs> yes. Victory kill. There goes Pachycephalosaurus. Wow, Eocarcaria. It's not stopping. If I was you, Saltosaurus, I'd run. Oh, okay. Nope. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Slap that mofo into the floor. Oh, wow, really? You're going for Saltosaurus? <laughs> we just, we've got a three minute massacre from Eocarcaria, yeah? Oh, no, he failed. The Saltosaurus actually survived. Good on it. As opposed to the Triceratops that did not survive. And Delta Dromius picking up another kill, another victory. Look at Tiny Doll, oh, no. Run tank. It's like standing on Lego Brook. Ah, tactics from the Supersaurus. He's sleeping so no one can hunt him down. No one can fight him. Like, out of the sauropods, he definitely deserves to win. That doesn't mean he will, but we'll see. So, that's Delta Dromius and Eocarcaria are the only two carnivores left. Right, if they do both get killed, um, I will decide that I'll probably give the victory to Supersaurus because he has survived the most hunts. I think Seismosaurus has only been hunted like twice. Isosaurus has had a few. Amplosaurus has probably had more. I'll give Uluru Titan and Syntosaurus credit for surviving. And I'll give it as a win. Yeah, I'll give it as a win for all the herbivores. I'll probably, like I usually do, pick out one in particular. Oh, there goes Kentrosaurus, finally. <laughs> finally that thing pops. It, well, it, it doesn't do that fall. Wait, why is it a tyrant? <laughs> it hasn't done anything. Wait, it gained infamy after that. It's like a freaking tyrant. Well, there you go, Kentrosaurus dead. I think it came in like 10th, because we got a few left. No, oh, I think, is this the end for Saltosaurus? You know, I'm make, making this return. The Eocarc here is eyeing him up. Oh, oh, maybe not. Wait, is he going to escape again? Run your little legs off. Run, little put put. Go, 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 go. Oh, no. Ulura Titan's gone. When did the Delta Dromius kill the Ulura Titan? It did get too close. But I tell you what, it came in 10th place. So you give it, or give it respect. Oh, the Super Seismosaurus is uh, getting up by the looks of it. <laughs> the friggin' Saltosaurus escaped again. <laughs> Man, that thing is, just doesn't know how to die. Right, here we go. It's, are they fighting? And is Eocarcaria getting the first hit? Delta Dromius responds with a shot of his own. Oh, they're going to call it. Okay. Oh, we have an injury. And it's laceration. That's it for Delta Dromius. He is done. The laceration is going to finish him off. And it is Eocarcaria that's going to be the last carnivore standing. And it's hunting, apparently. I don't know what it's hunting. Oh, no. The last of the Hadrosaurs is going down. And it is Synteosaurus biting the dust. Eocarcaria taking him out, and that is ninth place for Synthiosaurus. Oh, this is his third attempt at hunting down the Saltosaurus. Is it going to be third time the charm? Yes, it is! No! The Saltosaurus couldn't get away. And Eocarcaria finally gets it done. And that is an eighth place finish for Saltosaurus, which is bloody respectable. Let's give it its props. And I think, yeah, there it is. The finishing blow of, of Delta Dromius. And he comes in seventh place. And that does confirm that Eocarcaria has won out of all the carnivores. He is the last one standing. 
with 14 victories, 8 kills, 5 prey kills. And, well, if he can finish off these sauropods, he will win. Now, the fairy can fight him, but for whatever reason, the fairy just doesn't want to fight. Ooh, hang on a minute. We got a plot twist. It's Eocarcaria taking on the Ferrazinosaurus. Hmm, that does shake things up. And Eocarcaria does get the first hit, so... Low... Oh, wow. Okay, the fairy did survive that encounter, but it did take quite the beating. And the Eocarcaria yet again racks up victory number 15. Oh, he's going for it again. This is not good for the Isosaurus. He is in trouble now. And it's a fatal injury. The Isosaurus is going down. Eocarcaria gets the kill he needed because he was getting hungry. And that is it for Isosaurus. Coming in six. Well, it did well, but yeah, that surface wounds injury really done damage. And is this going to be the end for Ferry? I think it might be. Eocarcaria is really mopping up here. And yeah, there it is. Ferrazinosaurus gone. Coming in fifth place. And yeah, that's it. That's it now. I, that's it. I'm going to end it here because Eocarcaria is unstoppable at this point. Nothing can fight it. Right, okay, here's where things get a wee bit complicated. So, our scenario is that I've been at this for over an hour, and for some reason, like, the Eocarcaria will just not attempt to hunt these sauropods. And yeah, I'll put some uh, food down for it, and we, we got a sandstorm as well. We've got injured. Oh, I think one of these guys. So, yeah, so... Basically, I've gone through the recording, I have checked how many times these guys have been hunted down and that, and I'm going to count each time it survived as a victory threat. And if it loses a certain amount of health from that hunt, I will count it as a loss, so it'll be like a fight, similar to the fight record. And on that basis, I am going to give Eocarcaria the victory. You know, I think he deserves it. And you know, like I said, it's not the game's fault that it's dumb enough to not hunt while it's hungry. <laughs> so I think I will give Eocarcaria the win. And uh, Supersaurus I will put in second place because it has by far survived the most hunts. In fact, it's been hunted about 16 times when I checked the recording. Most of them you won't even see because I'll cut it all out. Like if I, if I put the whole video up, it would be almost three hours long. This was mental. But yeah, I, Supersaurus will get second place. Uh, Ampelosaurus will also get third place. That thing was hunted seven times, actually. Mostly by Eocarcaria. Oh, they are kisses. And seven times is nothing compared to the Supersaurus, which was hunted over 15 times. And I think about six of those, it didn't take any damage. Which I think is, was mental. And in fact, it would, might even have more fighting victories than the Eocarcaria, but uh, yeah, I'll give Eocarcaria the win. Supersaurus will finish second, Ampelosaurus will get third, and Seismosaurus, which was actually only hunted three times, I'll give fourth. So yeah, hope you enjoyed, and until next time, ta-ta! Mm -hmm.